This is the MLB pregame show, and I'm Matt Vaskersian. And as we draw nearer to the first pitch of Game 1 in the series, we'll give you the latest installment of our Tops Player Spotlight. Damian Ryu is our subject, and he had the long ball working in his last game. Three home runs really carrying his team on his back. Yeah, we see it maybe a couple times a year, but when a guy gets three homers in a game, it's always worth talking about. He got some good pitches to hit, and he just flat out did not miss them. I mean, I've seen guys put fewer out in a home run derby round, so he's clearly got plenty of power in that swing of his. And who knows, maybe he'll put on another show in this one. I wouldn't put it past him. Okay, Eric, Steve, and I are ready for baseball, and we'll have it for you next on the show. Friday night baseball now from the Lone Star State and Minute Maid Park in Houston. Tonight, the first of this three-game weekend series between the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim and the Houston Astros. It'll be fun watching these two swing it all series long. First pitch is next. And now we'll look at Mike Sosha's lineup for the visiting Halos. Who do you have your eye on, E.K.? Well, Matt, keep an eye on that number two spot. He was a run-producing machine last month, driving in over 30 runs. He just kept coming through with runners in scoring position, and he found a variety of ways to get it done. That's doing what it takes to help your team win ball games. Damian Ryu will stand in fresh off a four hit ball game back on Wednesday. Into the windup and the pitch. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Kiermeyer is underneath this one. And that's out number two. And with that, let's take a look at the Angels starting lineup. Anybody catch your eye, Eric? You know, they're getting a lot of production out of that number two hole right now. He's been on an absolute tear lately, hitting over 500 in his last 10 ball games. Jason Castro gets his first chance here, looking to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. Two down now. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second. And indeed it will. He throws him out at first, and the side is retired. Astros go down 1-2-3. They still trail 1-0. Digging in the switch hitter, Damian Ryu, as the switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. Yeah, he's got great numbers hey, right pitch. here. Hitting big over York. 350 against righties where he just rakes. Hey, come on, big dog. Get your pitch. He's set. Here it comes. Oh, and here's a fastball right down the middle of the plate that swung on and hit out to deep left field. And this one's not coming back. This is a long home run. And there it is. Damian Ryu is the new single season home run king. He now cruises around the bases knowing he's just toppled a long-standing record, one regarded as the jewel of Major League achievements. What a thrill for us to witness, and as you can tell, the fans are certainly grateful as well. And you have to wonder what is going through his head right now, Matty. The home run record is one of the most hallowed records in all of sport. Well, take a curtain call, big fella. You definitely earned it. Yeah, and guys, this is one of the reasons why this is such a hallowed record. As you just said, Eric, it's because it requires such a ridiculous level of consistency throughout an entire season. I mean, he flat out didn't go through a home run hitting slump at all. And if he had, we would not be witnessing the momentous occasion right now. And he will always be remembered for having one. Number 16 steps in now. Hey, come on now. Here we go. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second. Right. Left. 
And a bit of a high throw that time, but not much problem over there at first as that will end the inning. Nothing across here this half of the inning. Five innings complete. The Halos lead this one three to one. Hey, let her fly up there, huh? Damian Ryu will stride in, but first we take you back to the third as you take another look here at his two-run homer that had him rolling early on. Hey, come on, baby. See it. Hey, get your pitch. Drive it right here. This is skied into the air to straightaway center. Kiermaier moves over. Looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. Kevin Kiermeyer will stand in now. He's singled and struck out in two trips. Hits are now even at four apiece. Hit out towards second. To his right, right. Throw gets him, two down. Damian on, Ryu takes his go. turn now, looking to add some insurance to their lead in the form of that run standing out at second base. Yeah, a base hit right through the infield would probably do it, but you can bet those guys in the outfield are going to be coming up gunning if they get any chance at all. Swing and a ball yanked down One the right guard. field line. Two, two, two. Oh, and this is past him down the line. A fair ball. The run scores from second, and it's a 4-1 game. And he's safe. Well, that's what he's done well all season. Mets swing the bat with runners in scoring position. He drives in another one here on the RBI double. Mike Trout stands in, reached on a walk in his last trip. Hey, keep it going. I need you right now. Ready with the 3-0 pitch. No oh, offer the there from Trout as that nice. misses, and he'll take the walk. And for as hot as this guy's been recently, <laughs> this is a no-brainer. Take the bat out of his hands any chance you get. C.J. Crone will stand in now, hoping to get on track as they've been able to neutralize his power out of the cleanup spot. 0 for 3 thus far. Well, guys, it just hasn't been his day. You know, sometimes cleanup hitters are sort of all-or-nothing type hitters. But hey, stand up, stand up. Chance to make and the throw to first is there. The inning is over. Four to six to three. They roll it up to get out of the jam. More to come from Houston after this. Handful of fine individual performances to choose from in this one, boys. But what do you say we go ahead and let this man take home the hardware? He's our tops player of the game. Yeah, he came through with a couple of hits. But more importantly, that big home run, which really led his guys to this victory. So that's a wrap here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Eric Karros and Steve Lyons, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB 